Yosef and um, Lucas and um, Rema. So that'll be team one. So here we go. So it'll be we Jeff. got all in the spin, guys. <laughs> Yosef, <laughs> Lucas, and Rema. Okay. So that'll be, let that be team one. Okay. And then team two will be whoever's left. So who do we have? We have uh, team two, Italo. Okay, so team two will be Italo. Okay. Um, Mauricio. Oh, Mauricio! Hello, how hello, how are here? you? <laughs> okay. And thanks, Rem, thanks. I have already Sumaya. What is my team? Uh, you are going to be on team two, and I will show you in just one second. Okay, so who am I forgetting here? It, me. Oh, who's Lucas. that? No, who's I got that? Yosef. You're on. You're on team one. I got Yosef. I think it's Lucas. Team two. Or wait, no. Yeah. Did somebody leave, Jose? It's so hard when people come and go. Okay, so this is what I have for team two. So, am I forgetting anybody? Okay, so, oh, now Eric is here. Okay, <laughs> Eric, when did you get here? <laughs> okay, who left? Somebody left. Um, Rama, did Rama leave? Yes, I'm here. Okay, so Eric, you're gonna be on team one. Okay. Okay, so team one, Eric. Team one, Eric. Maurice, what team? Sorry, which my team? You Me? are okay, so here, I'll say what I have. Okay, so team one is Jeff, Yosef, Lucas, and Eric. Alright. All right, team two, I have Italo, Mauricio, Maya, and Jose. Are we good? Okay. Yes. All right, let's yeah. hope. Let us hope. Um, uh, okay. <laughs> so, Jeff, they're already giving you Trump problems. Okay, so now let me pull this up here. Hang on. <laughs> All right, uh, close this. Yeah. Okay. Uh, mm. Screens. Jeopardy. There we go. Okay. So let me hope that this is showing for you. Not yet. Okay. Here we go. All right. So we have Jeopardy here, <laughs> that which I'm sure you've played a million times. Um. So. The categories today are, because remember everybody, this is beginner English, so even if it's a little easy, we have to stick with it because um, the class is a beginner. Okay, so we have colors, animals, idioms, jobs, and furniture. So those are our categories. <laughs> All right. Okay, All right. so... Um, um, why? We'll just be different. We'll start with team two. All right, Italo, pick a category. Oh, I'm sorry. First of all, do you guys know how to play Jeopardy? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So here's how. Okay, I'm sorry. It's just so. Okay, it's so common that I thought. Okay, so here's how it goes. So what you do is you. The goal of the game is to get as most the most points for your for the team, right? Team with the most points wins. Team with the most points wins. Okay, so okay. the way it works is so you decide. So like if, if Italo, you're gonna go first, you might say, Okay, I'll take and this is how you have to it's a little bit of it a little bit of some fluency here. You say, I'll take furniture for 10, please. Or you could say, I'll take furniture for 40, please. It's up to you. But the the lower the points, the easier the question. So um, 
you have to be really confident <laughs> and that's how it goes and if you don't get it then it goes to the other team and they get a chance all right so um, so you can decide like which one you want to take and then so let's say you let's say I'll take colors for 10 then I show you the question um, and you um, you can try to um, figure it out um, you can um, um, see if you can guess you can you can also work with your team so um, you know the team you can I guess all you could do is chat with one another so you can work with your team to get the right answer okay. so you'll just have to use the chat it, it's not perfect because we don't have private chat so um, yeah. yeah so it's not perfect but um, uh, it's a little problem, but it's just for fun anyway. So, so if yeah. you're not sure, Italo, then your team members, your team members are Mauricio, Sumaya, and Jose. You can ask them for help. You can kind of see, take their hints. But Italo, since you're first, you have to say the answer, even if your teammates give it to you. And then um, team one again is Jeff, Yosef, Lucas, and Eric. All right. Are there any questions? All questions. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. no uh, 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 a, a little. Uh, can you speak a little? Is is uh, low? A little, oh, a, a slowly. Little. I'm sorry. Yes, I yeah. will speak <laughs> more slowly. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm absolutely. I shall speak more slowly. Okay. All right. So, team two, Italo. Are you ready? Italo. Are you ready? Italo. <laughs> Italo? Yeah. Are you there, Italo? He's not here. He's, he's not gone. Here. Did he leave? He's uh, gone. No, he's here. Okay. All right. Then who else is on your team? Mauricio. All I am right. here. I am here. What would you like? Okay, Mauricio, you're next on the team. So, what would you like? I am like animals. Okay, so you take, you say, I'll take animals for 10 points, or I'll take animals for 20. You decide which one you want. I want animals for 10, for 30, for whatever. Uh, 14. Okay, so you say, I'll take animals for 10. Let me hear you say that. Yes. Um, elephant. No, 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 no. Say, no. Re repeat. Say, I'll take. I will, I, I, I will take. Animals. Animals. For 10. For 10. For okay, 10. perfect. Okay, so now I will show you the question. Here's a question for 10. Okay, animals for 10. So I have to scooch down here. Oops, animals. What category was that? I'm sorry. Animals was. No. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> animals is the second category. Okay, so I'm going to scooch down here. Five, six, maybe. Uh, um, okay, animals for 10. Can you see? Yes. Yes, it says animal this barks. animal. This animal barks. The dogs. What animal? We'll say again. Dogs. Perfect. So team two, bravo! You get team. You get ten points. All right. Team one, Jeff. Let me go back to our categories. All right, Jeff. What would you like? Let me scooch this up. Uh, all right. Uh, I'll take um, animal for 20. Okay, animals for 20. So I got to skim down here. So that's going to be uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It's going to be slide 7. Okay. Yep, 7. Nine. Okay. Here we go. This animal is king of the jungle. Lion. Bravo, lion. Very good. Excellent. And let me put this in the chat box. Okay, so 
Um, <laughs> we had dog. That was the answer. Dog was the answer to the first question. The next one was lion. Dog? Dog? Uh-huh. Yeah, the one that Mauricio did, I think, was dog, and oh, okay. the one that lion, the one that Jeff did, was lion. Very good. All right, team two. Uh, Sumaya. Let me put this back. All right. What would you like, Sumaya? We have colors, animals. Idioms, jobs, or furniture. Sumaya, are you there? She's on chat. Ah, all right, Jose, you're up. What would you like? She, uh, she wants animal then. Animals? It's my turn. It's my turn. Yeah, Jose. Uh, animal third. Okay, so you say, I'll take... Uh, you take animal 30. I'll take animals for 30. Very good. For 30, okay. Good. I'll take animals for 30. So here we go. Which way? We did this one. We did this one. All right. Animals for 30. Team two. All right. So that line was 20. Okay. This animal is from Australia. Kangaroo? Bravo! Oh my God! Yes, kangaroo. Boy, I didn't. Uh, I did not fool you one bit. Very good. Okay, so that was. He's a student. He's from Australia. Yeah, you could have also said you could have said kangaroo, which you did, or you could have said uh, koala bear, uh, or uh, th those were the two I was thinking that you might say. Kangaroo or koala bear. Very good. All right, so team two. Excellent. Team one, your turn now, team one. So, Yosef. Okay. Okay, let me move this back. Sorry that this is kind of, like, cheesy, but... <laughs> <laughs> cheesy cheesy means, um, okay. like, not the best. Okay, so uh, who yeah. did we say... Yosef, team one. Okay, yep. now up to you. Um, I'll take colors for 50. Okay, I'll take colors for 50. Let me just um, bold these out that we did already. Strike through. We did these. That one's done. We did animals for 20. Font. Strike through. And we did, an oops, we did animals for 30. Uh, font. Strike through. All right. You said colors for 50? Yep. All right. Here we go. Colors for 50. So that's blue. That's going to be slide, like slide 7. Okay. Here we go. When Americans talk about paper money, they talk about the blank back. Paper... That's a hard one. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it's worth 50 points. But don't forget, you can talk to your teammates. So, Yosef, your teammates are Jeff, Lucas, and Eric. So you can use the chat okay, and, think, see <laughs> and see if you can figure it out. <laughs> Time. <laughs> No, this is beginner, so no no real time limit. Come on. <laughs> Three, two, <laughs> uh, one. It's a hard one. <laughs> it is a hard one. Bang. Okay, come on, Jeff, where are you? Lucas, Eric, come on. Help him come out. Come on, guys. Time out. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh. All right. <laughs> okay, but okay, um, Hector, that's good guess. It's a good guess, but the category is colors. So good guess, though. All right. All right. Okay, so now, all right, team one. I'm sorry, team two. Team two. You get a yes. chance, Jose. Yes. <laughs> all right, you get a chance, Jose, and your team. Um. When Americans talk about paper money, they talk about the blank back. Hmm. 
come back. Come. Okay, but don't forget category, colors. color, color. colors, oh. right? Yeah. <laughs> we can try too. Yeah, anybody can try just for fun. Is it, is it green back? <laughs> Oh, who said that? The green back. Ah, bravo! Yes, the green back. Bravo. Because, I got ah, bravo! Because <laughs> our, um, oh, do you know? Wrong? Our money is green, right? American oh. money. Uh huh. American oh. paper money is green. It's green. green. Uh huh. Yes. So we talk about the green back. That means money. Green back. So you learn something. <laughs> the green back. <laughs> it means American dollars. <laughs> yeah. Ah, yes. That was a hard one. All right. So what's fair? I guess I'll split between both teams because you both did a good job. Okay. So I'll give each of you 25 points. Good job. All right. So, um, now we're back to team one. So, who, where are we? Team one. Um, Eric. All right. Yeah. Let me put this back up for you. <laughs> All right. There's a hard one. That was a hard one. Sorry. Because I knew, I knew that some of you would come who are not total beginners. This is why I did that. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> I okay, will so take jobs for 30s. Okay, I will take jobs for 30. Okay, so let me say colors for 50 we did, so let me strike through this. We did colors for 50. On. Strike through. All right. Colors for 50 we did. All right, you said jobs for 30? Yes. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Should be slide twenty. Okay. <laughs> okay. Around here. Okay. All right. A person who designs houses. A person. Uh, designer or ar architect? Oh, bravo. Very good. That was. Uh, all right. Uh, so that you were. Who was it? Eric. Very good. Team one. That was 30. Excellent. Oh, my God. Yes. An architect. Good. So let me just write this out for everybody so you can learn. An architect designs houses. Let me spell this right for you so I can be a good role model. Very good. And architect. Bravo, Eric. Really good. <laughs> Very good. Okay. So far, because, yes, we're playing a little game, but it's mostly for you to um, learn things. So do you have any questions so far? Anybody? <laughs> Good. So, you know, if nothing else, everybody learned about the greenback. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, good. So, when you, when, um, when, I, I, I taught you this because when you listen to CNN, you will hear them say like this. Today, <laughs> the greenback uh, fell 5% <laughs> against the yen. <laughs> against the Japanese yen. <laughs> you will hear this. <laughs> so this way, if you listen to... Um, you can listen to um, CNN and you can hear, um, You will. they will say this, the greenback, they'll talk about it though, <laughs> the greenback, and they mean the American dollar, yeah. <laughs> so hopefully, I hope that the next time you listen to CNN, they will say this. Um, they don't say it all the time, but often they do. Okay. 
Can you understand me, all of you? Can you understand? I'm trying to speak slowly. Yes. Okay, good. Yeah. Just, good. Okay, yeah. good. If I He's talk, good. good. If I talk too fast, you just um, stop me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 thanks. Very good. All right, and there we go. Next. Okay, so uh, that was Eric, did the architect thing, right? So now we're back to Italo, team two. All right. Italo, let me go back here. Italo, Jeopardy. <laughs> here we go. Okay, Italo, what would you like? <laughs> Italo. Where are you? This was Jobs 430, I think. We took great. Uh, ah, no. Uh, wait, uh, Miss, Miss, uh, uh, Italo, say me that have problem with the microphone. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, uh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. The, uh, Italo is now writing what? Okay. Uh, okay. No, no worries. We we will wait. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is good practice for you. Good good English practice. Very good. <laughs> okay. Uh, 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 Italo. Uh, what? Uh, wait, wait. I am, I am, I am right now to Italo. Okay. What? Uh, colors, animal, <laughs> uh, <medium. laughs> I, I, I am, I, I am, I am right to Italo. On oh, there, Sammy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, no problem. Okay. No. So lingo. Uh, George, oh, okay. Sorry. He says here he is. Wait, wait. He says idiom. Okay, idiom for what? For ten. I would recommend idiom for ten because they're hard. <laughs> okay. Oh, he's gonna go for thirty. Oh my. Okay. Idioms for thirty. Okay, so it's gonna be. This was twenty nineteen. So minus one, two, three, four, five, I'm six, looking seven, for so like thirteen. Okay, I think this is gonna be for thirteen. Let's see here. Uh, you go hold on. Tell that. Animals. Okay. All right, here we go. All right. When you leave your bed in the morning, we say you blank blank. Eight question is for? I think this is for 30, he said. This is for Italo or anybody on his team. I know, Rema. It will be hard cause, because I... I am a vicious teacher. <laughs> <laughs> this means really mean. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh... <laughs> Can I ask you something? Yeah, of course. Uh, is 15 to uh, want no an answer? Uh, can we answer team one? Yeah, if you're on team oh. one, absolutely. Yeah, sure. When time expires, yes. Okay, yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. I play first. Okay. So that was, it was, Italo. Okay, so, all right. So that, does it go back to Jeff now, I think? There are some answers in chat. Oh, no, he put it, Italo. Very good. When you leave your bed in the morning, we say you wake up. Okay, that's very close. It's very close, but keyword, keyword, leave your bed. Yeah. So when you leave your bed, what do you say? Or what, how we say you? All right, so good guess, Italo. Okay, Jeff, or Yosef, or Lucas, yeah. or Eric. Or actually, or Rema, because she really was part of Team One. Get up. Get up. Ah, bravo. Very good. Get up. Yes. We because get up. wake up is the moment when we stop our sleeping. Yes. That's correct. And get up is when you actually, um, get up is when you actually, like, um, leave the bed and start walking around and... Yes. Brush Stand your up. teeth and very, 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 very good. Okay, very good. All right, so this was what team? Who did this? This was team one, and all right. 
Okay, team two. All right, Mauricio. <coughs> All right, here we go. What would you like? Um, no, uh, okay. Uh, jobs is good for me. Okay, jobs is good for you. All right. I think somebody was trying to tell me a shortcut to strike through, I think. You were saying uh, control or something. Anyway, so 15. jobs for 10, Mauricio? No, 15. Ah, jobs for 50. Ah. Woo! <laughs> we know what we call you. We say, who is my team? Italo. Italo, you have Mauricio, Sumaya, and Jose with you. Okay. okay. All right, so this was for 50 jobs, so hang on, let me fix this. For 50, so this is going to be... Miss, 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 miss. Yes, uh-huh. Uh, wait, wait. 18, number 2, please attention. Follow. Um, okay, hold on. Let me share the screen back here. Hold on one second. Um, okay. Okay, what was your question again? I'm sorry, one more time, the, your question? Translator, teacher, in language. Oh. oh, a person, this person studies languages. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Yes. Translator? Yeah, sure, that's, it's not wrong. It's not wrong, it's good, you could say that. I was going to say, I was thinking in my head this one, linguist, linguist, but I will accept Translator, that's perfect. Very good. I did not even think of this. I did not even think of this. But it's, it's, bravo. That's all I can say to you. Bravo. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay, so that was for 50. All right. Team two, catching up. All right. Or team one, rather. All right. Uh, next. Um, Lucas. Yep. I think it's your turn. Okay, <laughs> okay, so let's see what we got here. All right, so we did jobs for 50. Let me strike this through. <laughs> you guys are doing really good. I'm, I am surprised. You're super smart. Woo! I think you all need to um, uh, come to the United States, and then all our problems can be solved. <laughs> That's what I think. <laughs> I think that um, the other countries have the best people. All right. Um, all right, Lucas. What would you like? Uh, I would take animals for. <laughs> so we have 40 or 50 left? 50? Wow. 50? 50 left, yes. Wow. Okay. All right, let's see what we got here. Um, this was where we... Uh, hold on. Oh, back too far, sorry. Uh, um, okay. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, oh um, this is the mascot of a Los Angeles soccer, or for you, you say football team. <laughs> so you could quick look on the internet. <laughs> Use Google, yes. <laughs> I'm using I will Google it. <laughs> Pictures. <laughs> Uh, where is it? It's hard, it's this hard. is the mascot of a Los Angeles soccer team. Oh no. <laughs> oh what is that? And I'll give it's... you a hint. They they call their name in Spanish. They call oh. their name in Spanish and then you have to translate it into English. <laughs> That's my hint. <laughs> Do you all understand hint? Hint is like a clue. Oh, uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But, but I, I'm Googling. Uh, I, I'm Google, but I can't find nothing about, uh, find oh, about it. Oh, 
Well, it's the name. It's like the name of a team, of a football team. Name of a, a, a soccer. Well, we call it soccer here. <laughs> oh, I, I really don't know. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I'm not sure what color he is. Um, Jose, no one? Oh, come on now. Let me see here. Hold on. <laughs> let me go to... Let, let me see if we can find this here. Um, <laughs> is it Ux? Let's see here. What is this? Okay. California. Ux. Oh, no. I mean, no. What do we call it? Okay. Um, hold on. WWW. Okay. Hold on. Uh, mm. <laughs> Okay, um, okay, here we go. I will what? have a moment. Um, oh, here we go. It's dark? No. I think I found it. It's a little harder to find than I thought. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> Okay. Bald. Here's your here's your here's your hint, which is essentially the answer. <laughs> but you have to translate it, right? Yeah. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I do mean team, Rema. And ox, Yosef. Mm, close, but not not quite. Bulldog. Nope. Bulldog. <laughs> Duck. Nope. <laughs> I don't think so. Not a duck. Did you uh, click on the link here? Can you see the picture? Uh, okay, yeah. Is that what it is, Jeff? Uh, I think he's, um... I think uh, he's... No ship. It's... Yeah, you have to find the word in English. Here. In Spanish, this is the word. Right? In Spanish. <laughs> How do we call that Paris? in English? <laughs> okay, all right. Ari's very okay. I'll take it. Yes, we say goat. We say goat in. Um, yes, very good. Ari is very good, Eric. We say goat in English. So goat, goat is. Um, yes, he's like a. Um, how can I? It was hard. <laughs> okay. Actually, I thought this. I thought I thought this might be easier Looks because like it was in Spanish. But I guess it's not the Spanish you know. See, this is what's hard because I don't really, I don't um, know that much Spanish. So I thought like Shivas would be easy for you, but it wasn't. So see, because you call it Arias, Arias, and or or Arias in your in your Spanish, right? Or Portuguese, you don't say Shivas. So it was difficult, and I apologize. I didn't mean to make it that hard. <laughs> I just wanted you to say goat. <laughs> goat. So goat is, um. oh, okay. Yeah, you could say billy goat, too. Absolutely. You could call this a billy goat. That's very good. Who is that? Johanna. A billy goat is um, a boy goat. A boy goat. Yes, a boy goat. <laughs> I'm not sure what we call a girl goat. All right, very good. Okay. <laughs> cabra. Cabra is in Portuguese. Oh, cabra for goat. Okay, so yeah, yeah. that's what. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so for this animal, or for this animal, we could say billy goat, or you could say goat. Um, that's or you could say mountain goat. Um, those those would all have been correct, I think. Yeah, a sheep is close, but not quite. A sheep is close, but not quite the same. <coughs> yeah, as a goat. Do you? Are these? I mean, I I mean, everybody has goats, right? I mean, goats are everywhere, correct? Yes. Just, okay, just checking, because like here here in Los Angeles. Um, the, I know I'm off the topic a little bit, but many people um, drink goat milk. They drink goat's milk. 
Yeah, so I don't know. Do you drink goat's milk? In but go goat is a male. Oh, okay, yes, but that's whatever you call a produce. female. <laughs> a billy goat is a male. A billy goat is a male, but... Um, oh, okay, yeah, I don't... In English, I think we just say goat... We say goat for female and billy goat for is, male, I isn't think. Isn't it a cow? Isn't it a cow called yeah, no, a cow is different, but um, okay, in the northeast of Brazil. So yeah, so we say goat for female and billy goat for male. But yeah, <laughs> it's very popular here. Um, very popular uh, to drink goat's milk. I'll say female goat just to make sure we're clear. <laughs> that healthy? Female goat's milk. Yeah. So um. I just I don't don't know. Anyway, yes, we have. So there's goats everywhere here. All right. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Next. Where were we? Uh, team back to team 1, I think. All right. Uh, is it er, is it Yosef? Where yes. Are we? yes. Okay, yes, Yosef. I, I think your time, I think. All right, Yosef. Okay. <laughs> so where are mm. we? Okay. So we did um, animals for 50. <laughs> That was hard. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean yeah. I did not want it to be that hard. <laughs> that was too hard. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll Yosef. take jobs for 40. Okay. Jobs for 40. So let's see. So two, this is 2, 3, 4, 7, 12, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't think this is it. We did this one. Oh, that was right. Okay. We did that one, so it's this one. All right. Here we go. This person cleans houses. Uh, I don't know what the cow cleans. Mine, sir. Uh, um, okay, no, it wasn't what I was thinking, Eat hello. <laughs> uh, <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe in maybe your country. Which <laughs> <laughs> thing is the term? There's a special, special word for this. Anyone? Housekeeper. I know, but... Okay, I'll take, okay, housekeeper, okay, I'll take it. Um, which team is this? This is uh, Yosef, so Yosef. team one. So Eric, it's your team. Yeah. So yeah, it could yeah. be housekeeper. Okay, so I'll take or it. Cleaner. Housekeeper could be one, but I was thinking of this one. It's, it, so you could learn a new word, which is maid. A maid. Ah, I know. A maid is a person who cleans ah. houses. Uh -huh. I know maid. It. Yes. So Me? hopefully. Miss, yeah, yeah. <laughs> miss, miss, miss. Yeah. Uh, uh, can you uh, write the in, on the chat the, this new word? Is I can understand. Oh sure. Did I put me? it in the wrong chat? I'm sorry. Made, made like this. Let's see. Because because for another countries the uh, this significates made like this. Have any more? M A I D. Can you see? Made. No. Oh maybe. Okay, I'll put it in this chat then. Made. I'm not sure which chat you are. There's two chats Made. here. Yeah, mm. click on the um, click. I'm sorry, click. Uh, Colingo icon. Yes, click on Colingo. That's the chat. Whoops, sorry. Thank you, Colingo. The Colingo icon. That's the chat that we usually use. Yes, maid. We say maid. A maid is a person. A maid is a usually a woman. Um. Mm. It is a woman who cleans houses, and then if if um um I mean usually it's a woman who cleans. That's this is the way it is. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> but if it is a man, if a man does clean, um, we call him differently. We call him a butler. A butler, if it's a man. So, um, cleaner, um, we, no, we don't, not for somebody who cleans house, we would say um, house cleaner, you could say house cleaner, if you like, house cleaner, maid, and somebody else said housekeeper, 
housekeeper. But yes, but no. If you just say, that's a good question, actually. And you're, I think the language of your name there is in Arabic. So I, of course, I don't read Arabic. So. Um, uh, house cleaner. Um, we said housekeeper. Yes, but it's it's not the best answer though. House cleaner is is not the best. You could say it, but it's not really. It's you could say it, but it's not really the best. The best, yeah. Um, if you said, "Oh, I want a house cleaner," they would say, "Oh, you mean a housekeeper?" Or they would say, "Oh, you mean a maid?" So yeah, <laughs> uh, yes. maid is yes. more like the job profession, right? Yes, uh huh, a little bit. Yeah, mm. exactly. Uh, because because for another countries this uh, this this profession have any more words. Oh, I see. Yes, in English we don't. I don't know why. That's very total, strange. Total. Yes. Yeah, it's a little strange. Yeah, um, yeah. Sometimes you can say you can say this, but this isn't really. This isn't really the right name. You can say we sometimes we say cleaning lady. Like we might say, I need to get cleaning a cleaning lady. Cleaning lady. Lady, yeah. Oh yes. Yeah. Um, but it's a little. Um, you in the other chat? You, our chat. Oh, which is up a page? Okay. So yeah, you found it in the dictionary. The okay. Yeah, the dictionary. Hmm. And you found it in Cambridge. Um. Which is uh, mostly British. Uh, the Cambridge Dictionary is mostly uh, British English, usually. So um, many of the words that you will find there we don't use here in English, and, and I'm sorry, in um, the United States. <laughs> so yeah, housewife. Mm, no. <laughs> um, yeah, um, you would if you said that here um, in the United States. I'll, my house, uh, a housewife is somebody who cleans. Um, they would no, definitely not mistress. No, not housewife. No, <laughs> neither one of those, Johanna. <laughs> yeah, both of those words are um, you should not say. And it, Italo is asking me how many points. Okay, you are team two, so fifty, seventy-five, hundred and hundred and five, hundred one fifteen. Italo, one fifteen for team two. And then I have 60, 70, 80, 90, 105 for team one. Uh, that's what I have so far. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now, where are we? We were, I forget now. Where were we? I was talking too much. I forgot. Um, let me go back to PowerPoint. Here we go. Share screen. Like, okay. Um, All right. Um, that was, who did that? Was that, that was, um, who just did the last one? Was that Lucas? No, Yosef, right? So now we are what, team two now? Yes, team two. Okay, team two. two. Okay, so I think Mauricio. I am here. Okay, so here we go. Let me move this back to our, the starting, sorry. Okay. It's hard. I, I think what I should do is, um, not do the PowerPoint. I should just get a whiteboard, I think. Okay. Um, so, Mauricio, team two, what would you like? Oh, furniture. Oh, furniture. Okay, furniture for 10, 20, 30, 40? Mm, no, now 10. 10, 10 so say, now. good. So you say, I'll take? Number 10. And no, I have fear <laughs> of lost. No, 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 but, no, but you, I want you to practice. Say, I'll take furniture for 10. Uh, no, I can understand, I cannot understand. What, what do you mean? Excuse oh, me? so I want you to say, I'll take furniture. Furniture? Uh-huh, for 10, we say, for, for 10. 10. For Bravo. 10. For, ah, good. okay. For okay, 10. Awesome. Uh-huh. Perfect. For, okay. No 10, for 10. For 10. Uh-huh. Very good. Oh, okay. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay. Uh, furniture for 10. Here we go. So this is going to be uh, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 12, um, 17, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. It should be a slight 23. Okay. Um... 
Okay, okay. here we go. This is an object people sit around to eat. Share a I screen. Am. Hold on. Oh, I'm not. Hold no, on. no. Oh, sorry. Where are we? Uh, hold on. Uh, share screen. Why won't it? There we go. Here we go. Okay. Can you see yeah. now? Okay. Yes, yes. Bravo. An object people sit around to eat. Oh. Oh. Can I answer? No. Yeah, ask, ask, absolutely. Yes. Yeah, uh, ask, ask your teammates. Chat, chat, chat. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you may. You, see, at beginner, you are allowed to ask for help. In beginner games, you can ask for help. We have advantages. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> okay, Johanna, you're close, but it's not a room. It's a piece of furniture, not a room. Right. Furniture. Furniture. <laughs> <laughs> But I'm impressed, Johanna, with your vocabulary. What All right. <laughs> so, Mauricio, do you have an answer? <laughs> uh, table. Table. Ah, bravo. So, yes, all of you in the chat out there in purgatory, we call it, <laughs> or the lobby, or lobby or purgatory. <laughs> bravo. Many of you did it, said it right. Good. The answer for this is a table, um, and this is where most people sit around to eat. Table. 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 Uh huh. Very table. good. So Mauricio, mm -hmm. you are on team two. So Mauricio, very good. Okay. Excellent. Dance. Dance. <laughs> very good. Table. Dance. All right. Let me fix this. Table furniture for ten gone. Or okay. Uh, furniture for 10, gone. Um, okay. All right. We are on now. Is it Lucas or yes. Eric? Who's next? I think it, Eric. I think so. Okay, yes. Eric. <laughs> <laughs> yes, okay. What would you like? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Jobs for okay. 40. Jobs for 40. Okay, so this is going to be 2, 7, 12, 17, 18, 19, 21. Okay, should be slide 21. Oh, we did that one. So here, we did that. Oh, sorry. Well, how did I miss? Did we? Oh, here it is. Okay. I guess I kind of mixed them up a little bit. Sorry about that. Okay. What do we call this? Wait a minute. A dog, okay. <laughs> I know, I see. Yeah, if you have your Santa hat on. Uh, oh, can someone tell me what I should do to become an active speaker? Um. Oh, for this, I think, Raphael, you must be actually in the class. Um, I think. Yeah. yeah. Good. Good. Very good, Eric. You must, I think this is true, correct? Students, you must be in the class to speak, I think. Right? They're asking. Polyglot. It's, it's a vegetarian. <laughs> Um, polyglot. I don't even know that word. Polyglot. Is it a vet? Maybe. Actually, Maybe. Um, in, in Portuguese, uh, we say polyglota, um, someone who speaks a lot of languages. Ah. 
Oh, for someone who speaks a lot of languages, right? Okay, but yes. But anyways, that um. So is it who was it, Mauricio? The answer for this: a doctor for animals is a veterinarian. Okay, so a doctor for animals is okay here a veterinarian. Veterinarian. I think. Let's see if I can spell this right. Veterinarian. Veter <laughs> Yes, or for short we say vet, for short because it's too long. <laughs> nice. Okay, polyglot. Oh, that makes sense. A polyglot. Okay, very good. All right, very good, Eric. Okay, so that was for forty, and Eric, you are on team Wrong. one. Okay. So hey, wait, 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 Miss, Miss. Yes. Uh huh. One question. Sure. What is the perfect word? Veterinarian or vet? Oh, well, we all say vet. Ah. Yes, yeah. um, because um, when you're speaking, just just speaking to your friends or speaking just in your family or in just every day, you say vet because it's short. Um, it, if you are, like, speaking very formally, like... I don't know, like in school maybe, or um, if you are writing something, then you say veterinary. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. But um, okay. yeah, normally okay. we like I'll say um, I have to take my dog to the vet. Please, uh, veterinarian. Yeah. Veterin uh -huh. Veterinarian? Yes, veter veterinarian. <laughs> <laughs> but we never, we always say vet. We say, I have to, or actually, really, you'll hear us say, I have to, I have to take my dog to the vet. You'll hear it. This is, this is how it'll sound. I have to. No, I have to take my dog to the vet, you'll say, which means I have to take my dog to the vet, but the vet. we say it very fast, and it says have. We say have to. I have to take my dog to the vet. Oh, a veterinary. Oh, a veteran. Uh, veteran. Veterinary. I think Eric, this is the place. The place. I think so. This is the place where uh, the vet works. I think so, Eric. The place where a vet works. Uh, is the veterinary. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, thanks. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Although, this is, again, very British. We don't use this word in, Engl in American English, veterinary. We don't use veterinary too much in American English. I've never heard it, actually. <laughs> yeah, we say the vet office. Very good. That's what we say, Jeff. Yep. Yeah, I got I have to I have to go to the vet's office. That's what we say. I have it's to slowly, it's slowly. Oh yeah, no no no, I'm saying <laughs> I'm saying um, that's that's how it will sound. So we will say I have to go to the vet's office, we'll say. Very good. Yes, okay. down the speed, please. Okay, I will slow down. Very good. I will. Okay, so who's next? Sumaya, are you still with us? I don't think so. She left. She left a long time ago. Okay, so yes. who are we then? I guess Jose then. Yes, All right, yeah, Jose. My <laughs> All right, Jose. Um, I would take the colors. Here. Colors, okay. Colors for forty. For forty, so this would be two, three, four, five, six. Okay, six colors for forty. Okay. Here we go. When a company makes money, we say in English, they are in the which color? <laughs> <laughs> green? Uh, we, we, we did green. Green we already used. Green is done. <laughs> mm -hmm. Not green or blue? No, not green, not blue. Nope. No. Nope. <laughs> All right. So now it goes to, um, uh, no, close though. Wow. I'm surprised. I thought that you would have this expression in your native language. I, I thought this expression 
or I thought this T H O U. I thought this was in every language. See, I'm learning too. I'm yeah, learning no. too. It's okay. Hard. This is hard. Okay, so the, the we say in the black. Um, so we say um, when a company makes a profit or they make money. When a company makes money, uh, we say a profit or makes or makes a profit or money. We say they are in the blank. I'm um, in the black. We say black. they are. We say in the black. So this, so you can remember, um, it comes from like the form. Oh, it's in the blue. That's interesting. Wow, I had no idea. Now I, I'm learning too. See, so um, yeah. So normally, like on the form, like the accounting form um, that we use, um, black means. Um, black is good, means you're making money, and red is bad, means you owe. Red means you owe money. You lost money. So, um, this, and at least here in the United States, black means um, you are doing well, it's good. Red means you are losing money. <laughs> so if you are in the black, this is good. If you are in the red, that's bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, um, very good. Let me give you, for those of you who are new, I always give the, um, I always give the Facebook link so you can join. Um, <laughs> here okay for those of you who maybe I haven't seen like Rema some of you I, I haven't Renee some of you I don't know and I'm, I'm not sure if I've seen you before or not probably but um, if you don't know there's a Facebook page for Co um, for Colingo and you can join and it just tells you information like what's happening and, and what's going on and all those things so okay and then later today I have study advisory uh, advisory it's at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time so that is in like four hours from now um, so if you have questions and this is I believe open for everybody it doesn't say beginning or advanced or anything so anybody may join so if you have um, questions about English class you're taking 